upgrade your smartphone with Appalachian Wireless, get $300 off selected models. Capture memories, stream, and stay connected with the latest technology. Visit one of our stores or AppalachianWireless.com right now. Canadian wildfire smoke reaches Pockville, Kentucky, causing air quality concerns. As you can see behind me, uh, over the mountains, there's a, a haze uh, across downtown Pikeville and across uh, Pike County. So it has definitely uh, been something that residents have noticed and public health has noticed as well. Authorities report that over 482 wildfires are currently raging across Canada, consuming nearly 30,000 square miles of land. According to the EPA and the National Weather Service, you know, the current air quality is considered unhealthy for special populations. And so we're certainly watching to see, you know, what happens over the next couple of days. Uh, today it is slightly improved as compared to yesterday but again remains in that unhealthy to special populations um, area. The AQI measures the level of pollutants in the air on a scale of 0 to 500 with higher numbers indicating poor air quality. If you do need to go outdoors and you do suffer from like respiratory disorders, heart and lung disorders, you know, maybe wear a mask. Uh, you might want to consider that, um, but mostly stay indoors if you can. Professionals anticipate improvements in air quality in the coming days, but they emphasize the need for caution and urge residents to stay informed about the conditions. Even healthy individuals might want to consider, you know, going from strenuous to moderate activities if they're outdoors. One way to check the current air quality is to visit the website airnow.gov where real-time updates are provided. Reporting from Mountaintop News, I'm Ethan Miller.